Good evening. I'm Maddie McQueen. We first reported on lake pollution in Hoover last month. Some residents alongside Paraside, Paradise Lake said stormwater runoff from construction development brought trash into their backyards. Now, this is not an isolated issue as some people living on Indian Valley Lake tell us that they're having similar problems. CBS 42 Scott Minshaw joins us now live in the newsroom. Scott, what are some of the biggest concerns that come with this pollution? Yeah, thank you, Maddie. Some people are concerned about their property values lowering, saying stormwater runoff is causing erosion and pollution. Today, I went out to a home on Indian Valley Lake and was able to see some of these problems firsthand. It's turbulent through here. Gene Carey has lived on Indian Valley Lake for over 20 years. Shortly after moving in, he bought the lot next to his home, which had lake access. From the bedroom window, I could see two and three pound bass up in that slough. This lot backs up to a 20 foot wide easement, which the city of Hoover has marked for public utilities. Kerry says stormwater runoff from this easement over the last 10 years has taken away his lake access. It diminishes the value quite a bit because you, you, you can't put a boat and have boat access onto the lake. Water flowing through the city of Hoover's easement is causing erosion ditches, just like the one I'm standing in. Now these can get up to 10 feet wide and six feet deep. The water's also bringing trash, just like this, right into the backyards of residents. I've been busy trying to get the city involved to take the responsibility for polluting this beautiful lake. While showing us around, Kerry points out the easement contains sewer lines, one of which has been exposed by erosion. Kerry worries raw sewage will spill into his backyard and the Indian Valley Lake if the sewer line is broken by a rock or debris. This is a catch basin for the Cahaba River. We don't need sewer in the Cahaba River. John Lida, president of the Hoover City Council, says city engineers are constantly working to address residents' concerns. Lida did not know if en engineers were working on the easement behind Carey's property, but said it's something engineers would likely look into. Live in the newsroom, Scott Minshall, CBS 42 News.